Hi everybody, it's Carrie here, and today I'm going to show you how to make nourish bowls with Epicure. So what is a nourish bowl? A nourish bowl is basically everything you need to make a complete healthy meal all put together into one bowl, or as I'm going to do today, in a mason jar. So by following Epicure's Good Food Real Results program, in our beautiful guide that it comes with, they've got a page all in nourish bowls, and they show you step by step how to put together a complete nourish bowl. So the first step in our nourish bowl is we're going to add the dressing. Um, today I'm going to feature one of Epicure's new nourish dressings. So if you can see that there, it's our miso and ginger. And what I love about all of our dressings with Epicure is they're clean, they're delicious, you're in control of the flavor, and you know what's in your dressing, no preservatives. What's even better about our new nourish dressings is that they're lighter than the regular dressings. They use less oil, and instead we're adding some real fruit juice. So how to make the miso dressing? Super simple. In a cruet, you're going to add a third of a cup of rice vinegar, a third of a cup orange juice, and I even had some oranges in the fridge, so I squeezed using Epicure Citrus Press the juice from one orange, and that made about a third of a cup. So a third of a cup orange juice, one quarter cup of oil, and then two tablespoons of the miso ginger dressing. And the recipe is simply right on the side, so it's so easy. So you're gonna add the dressing to the bottom of your nourish bowl mason jars. With the nourish dressings, you get more dressing. Uh, the regular line of dressings, you get one tablespoon. Using the nourish dressings, you get three tablespoons. So you're going to add three tablespoons to each one of your mason jars. Okay, so the dressing is added, three tablespoons, and a full recipe of the nourish dressing should do about four mason jars. Now we're going to add our grain or our starchy vegetable. So following the guide, you could do sweet potatoes, you could do quinoa. There's many, many options here. What I'm going to use today are vermicelli noodles, or rice noodles. Love, love, love these because they're so easy to make. I just take the dry noodle and you just put them under hot water and they're done. I even go as far as just using the hot water from my Keurig machine, pour it over to the noodles and they soften. So you're going to do a half of a cup of your grain or starchy vegetable into your mason jar. Now it's time for the veggies. So you're going to want one cup of chopped vibrant vegetables and then two cups of leafy greens or kale or um, broccoli slaw. So this is where you get to have a lot of fun with some Epicure tools of ours. So I'm going to feature Epicure's veggie twist. I love this. The one side of the blade or the end will make beautiful spirals. And the other side here will make what we call noodles. Isn't that cool? Well, look at these beautiful noodles. Like how cool does that look in a salad? The other great tool that we have is our ceramic slicer. So using the ceramic slicer, you can get beautiful thin pieces of carrot, or you could do celery. That takes no time at all to make thin strips of celery. You can even go as far as doing um, radishes. Now in this case, I would put the guard on. So you're gonna get thin strips of radish. Look at that, is that awesome? You could also use your veggie twist and do ribbons of carrot. So just twist your carrot and you're gonna get beautiful ribbons. When you get close to the end, this is the guard with the veggie twist. You're gonna to wanna to just shove it onto the vegetable and use the guard, okay? So look at this. Sometimes salads can be boring, but if you make fun vegetables like this, no salad needs to be boring anymore. Even using that, you could make beautiful little um, what we call rosette. So if you were decorating a veggie tray or decorating your salad or nourish bowl, look at that. Isn't that neat? A little rosette. So you're going to chop up all your vegetables and you're going to add one cup of vibrant chopped vegetables in here. Look at all those beautiful vegetables. 
All right, after the one cup of vibrant chopped vegetables is in there, you're gonna add two cups of leafy greens like spinach or kale um, or broccoli or cabbage slaw. So two cups on top. All right, so now we've got uh, our greens. This all look delicious. just amazing, eh? So vibrant and colorful. Now we're going to top it with your lean protein and tons of options here. You could do chicken, you could do turkey, um, you could do ham, you could do um, fish, you could also go med style and you could be doing um, half of a meat and half of a bean or you can go vegetarian and you can do your beans or your cottage cheese or your prepared hummus. There's many, many options here. Um, so what I did is I cooked up a chicken breast in Epicure's multi-purpose steamer. I just did up one chicken breast for, for my lunches for this week and it honestly took four and a half minutes and my chicken breast was absolutely perfect. Perfect. So I'm just going to cut up that chicken breast and uh, it's four ounces of chicken. So I'm going to split it and I'm going to do um, half chicken and half chickpeas. I love chickpeas. And I'm going to go med style, so half beans, half um, of meat. So I'm just going to chop up my chicken breast using our 5-inch ceramic knife that glides through that chicken breast like butter. Amazing. Okay, so my chicken's all cut up. So I'm going to do half protein. Uh, half my protein is going to be the chicken. I'm just going to divide that out the jars and then the other half I'm gonna do half a cup of chickpeas so you really can customize these um, and make them different every week so that uh, you don't want to make you want to make sure that your lunch is exciting you don't want it to be boring or else uh, it's no fun so make it colorful lively and delicious so now you're gonna put your lid on here, you're gonna seal it, you're gonna put it in your fridge, it's gonna stay fine for the week, um, and you can just pull this out, take it to the office, have it ready for lunch, and when you go to serve it, you're going to, because I'm gonna eat this one today, you're gonna to flip it upside down, and this is gonna allow the dressing to run through your salad. Or you can shake it up, pour it into a bowl, a plate, and enjoy. So enjoy having a nourish bowl in a mason jar, quick, easy, simple, prep ahead and enjoy healthy lunches throughout the week.